Hello, and welcome to another Let's Play. Me, Game of 6 of Red Dead Redemption 2. On the last Let's Play, we hunted, and I think we caught a guy. I can't exactly remember when one of the Let's Play starts and the other stops. So we're going to rob a train. Feels good, doesn't it? But we need to get this done fast. Now it's thawing before anyone gets up here after us. Oh, look at you boys. See? This is what I call a crew. Micah Bell, Charles Smith, Arthur Morgan, Javier Escuela, and what about young Lenny here? Always the first man on his I guess if you're a leader, then it's easier. Just happy we're back at him, One of your skills is to learn everybody's names. Of course I'm ready. Took me about, like... Five, six months to learn all of my roommates' names. Granted, there were seven of them. And I just mean the first names. So we do this, then we go back to Blackwater to collect. How many times you gonna ask the same question, Micah? That's a lot of damn money to leave Sydney for too long. It would be crazy to go back there now. The place will be swarming with Pinkertons. We go back when I say we go back. And that's the end of it. Money safe. You'll just have to trust me. And if the O'Driscolls are right, there'll be a stack of railroad bonds on this train. Good money once we work out how to cash them. Now, everyone, shut up and get your mind on the job at hand. Come on. There's the water tower. Hold up here on the ridge. Is Bill there? Yeah. You want to head down? See how he's getting on? Okay. I guess this way? Hey, right, boy. How you getting on? Yeah. yeah. I'm okay. You sure? Of course. Can I help a little? All right. Go ahead and set up the detonator by those rocks over there. Okay, sure. Now just unspool the wire and then attach it to said detonator. Okay. That thing over there? Okay. Now, if I was that guy, I would want to not be right next to the dynamite when it's attached. That should do it. You head back up to the others. I got it from here. So, like, was there a battery inside that detonator, and that's how that works? No mistakes. What's going on? He says all fine. We'll soon find out. Everything okay? I think so. Okay, cover your faces. Train should be here any minute now. I need to remember to cover my face in one mission. Because I remember one I did in this game, and I'm not sure if you can put a thing, but like I rescue a guy, and then he gets be shoot our way through town, and then uh, the law has a bounty on my head. Where did you find that moron? You said 
said it was fine. Come on! You're pathetic. You know oh that. god, the frames. What's going on here? You alright, game? Maybe after this one we'll try and reset or something. Here we go! Here we go! Here we go. Long live the king. I got you. Now stop yelling. Oh. Yeah, you're okay. Now, let's go slow this thing down. Where's Javier? Fell off the train. The others will get him. Probably have to kill these guys. Anyone in the back area? Just you? On sec, I have to loot this guy. Really? It unequips my thing? Anyone else? I'm not sure if he's a guy. I mean, you all could see me hooking up the wire. I mean, do we have to hurry? Unsec. Okay. Big time vent. Bit busy here. Be good. I was going to say. I was going to say he was going to be fine, but it looked like he landed on his head. Look out. Got more coming off the train. There better be some money at the end of the All these bastards must be guarding something. So I saw there was an aiming thing. Okay. Oh, frames, what's going on? You guys can take care of them, right? He takes a long time to loot. I probably should hide. Maybe loot a bit.
I'm sorry, I was low on health and I needed to heal. Hey, I'm getting stuff so I can donate some to you guys later. Come on. What are you doing? Get over here. You two all right? Yes, let's get the money and go. We got some fellas hold up. There's more money on these guys than in that train. Shit. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Listen to me. We don't want to kill any of you. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our orders. Okay. You asked for it. We ain't Five, opening this door. Four. Three, two, one. Seems our friends have gone deaf. Good thing they don't Where seem to have any guns to uh, shoot out the thing. My hand just being like that. That's enough. Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. You two boys go blow that door open. Okay. Oh god, the frames. Too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a step back. Seems good enough. Here we go. Now light the fuse. Unless you got a death wish, I'd step back, fellas. There's a corpse over there that I need to get. Where's my gun? My, oh we didn't my. want to rob your boss. Get on up there. Search that train. <laughs> hey, me first. Look at this place. <laughs> it's yeah, it's nice. Well, now I've seen everything. Oh, you two got the safe? I'll search the rest. Oh, yes. Should be easy as cake. <sighs> You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will ya? I'm parched. Shut up. Me and Arthur did all the work. Yeah, kid did good. Didn't see you rushing to jump on that train. He's king. I'll give you that. Okay, let's see if we can get this open. Door when I say so. Come on. Come on. Get in there. Any brandy? Well, that looks like a thing. Good thing it wasn't locked. I don't think so. Here, make yourself useful. At least we all know you can read. Give me those. Think I got them. Nice. Well, thank God. Come on. I can't take any more cigars. I guess I took so much shit that um. The game's like, hey, uh, you're rich, so. Just waiting on you, Arthur. Booby rookie card. Platinum Christ. No wonder the gaming is, gang, gang is suffering. We're not getting anything because we just go, Ooh, there's platinum shit in here. Ugh. Who needs platinum? Nobody's going to pay for what platinum. What did you buy? These bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. I think we can probably sell these pretty easily. <clears throat> well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah, get it out of here. What about them? What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. See you back at camp. When you get back, we'll be moving on. 
The rest of you, let's ride. Yeah. I always don't, or almost always don't kill guys in video games, cause like. Yeah. Okay. Get on the train, quick. Because right. like that re reduces right. the amount of guys in the game. So behave. Come on, move. We won't tell a soul. I swear. Yeah, just get on. Said quick. Get on the train. Ooh, but I do want to get uh, loot some more guys. I don't know why the game's been doing what it's been doing recently. The only thing I could think of is maybe there's some kind of background thing going on. Or B. Um... The laptop just can't keep up with the game and then slows down just a little bit to uh, try not overheat. Because it's probably at like 90 and 100. Asus used to make good computers. Nowadays, not so much. That's why I'm planning to get a desktop. Whenever graphics cards become available. And with all the things I got, I'm told I could run these games at 50 centigrade instead of 100. So how does that work? Maybe he puts it on a low-ish setting so it doesn't, you know, capsize. Why did you take your face mask off? They could take a quick look and identify you as... 40-something-year-old, rough-looking dude with beard? There aren't a ton of those in the Wild West, you know. Oh, for Lord's sake! Put that book away and go help! Oh, Mary Beth. So, we getting out of this hellhole? We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed a Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question uh, is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. Well, then let's go. Clean noses and everything else. Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. And there we go, out of the prologue. I think after this let's play, I'm gonna go get some lunch and check on all this stuff. Let my computer cool down a bit. And my room to cool down a bit, because I have the door closed. You know, to prevent people from hearing me playing video games, talking about whatever. Yes, boss. You two right and it gets damn hot. Sure there's no surprises. We've had enough of those. Me with the boy? Just go. Come on, kid. You can buy me a whiskey. all the frame like what happens there Get us out the street. oh the back uh wheel doesn't look good ah, shit. okay 
Let's take a look. You all right back there? Does everything look all right? Well, what's going on? Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. All right, let's get it fixed. You need help? I wouldn't say I broke. We can handle it. More of it fell off. All right, Charles, you and me hold the thing up while you try and put the wheel back on, Arthur. You still strong enough to hold up a wagon? Shut up. I'm just saying. Don't say less. Pick the wheel up. <laughs> Nearly there. There. See? You ain't so useless after all. <laughs> Not quite. What do you think? If they wanted trouble, we wouldn't have seen them. Poor bastards. We really screwed them over down here. And we'll continue to screw them over for a hundred if another hundred well, years. Get in. I'll tell you. It's amazing how America it doesn't seem to, you know Not too far now. that the genocide of Native Americans is just like, oh, that's yeah, whatever, just kind of a thing that happened and not talked about to the degree of the Holocaust. This is the heartlands we're going to. Good farming and grazing country. They lost it all. Stolen clean away from them it was. Every blade of grass. Killed or herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. Mm -hmm. And how's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. I've seen a reservation. I heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? Mm -hmm. We don't. In spite of that, just talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our block-headed driver here. Hey, don't blame it on me. Never forget, this here's a con man, Charles, born and bred. Just because it sounds fancy, oh, there we go he again. knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. So it's like, in the Holocaust, there were 6 million Jews, give or take, and 5 million non-Jews, but there were 100 million Native Americans. When was the last time you've seen one of them? At least, not that I can remember. My father was a colored man. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did. When we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. Oh, life I've been on the run. A couple years later, some soldiers You're now hot. This is shown by flashing. Took us somewhere. We never saw her again. We drifted around. He was a very sad man, and the drink had a mean hold on him. Mm. Around 13, I just took off on my own. That was about the age we found young Arthur here. Maybe a little older. A wilder delinquent you never did see. But he learned fast. Not as fast as Marston, apparently. Wait. I don't understand. What's the problem between you two? Arthur? Yeah, it's a long story. We still heading the right way? That depends. Are we still heading west in search of fortune and repose in virgin forests as we plan? No. Are what are you, are you looking for in virgin forests? On our desperate escape from the law eastwards down the mountains? Yes, I believe so. You know this area? A little. I've been through a couple of times. There's a livestock town not too far from here called Valentine. Cowboys, outlaws, working girls. Our kind of place. Driscolls? Probably them too. Pinkertons? Let's hope not. Hopefully I don't get ambushed in this game. Wait, but what's it called again? Horseshoe Overlook. It's a good place to lie low. It'll do for now. And how low do you think Dutch is really going to lie? It's just, you know, maybe it's me who's changed, not him. But we kept telling him that fairy job didn't feel right. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. Maybe. It just isn't like Dutch to lose his head like that. Things go wrong sometimes. 
People die. It's the way it is. Always has been. Me, you, Dutch. We've all been in this line of work a long time. And we're still here, so... Well, I figure we must have got it right and a hell of a lot more than we got it wrong. To add more things, like, I, I've... Well, we've driven through a reservation once. It was like when we went to the Grand Canyon. Grand Canyon's in the middle of nowhere. You go to even more in the middle of nowhere. And... You pass some reservation, and it's... No stores. Just a couple of... Uh, what it, it looked like a trailer park in the middle of nowhere with nothing, just humongous amounts of poverty. Yep. America took everything they had, put him in the middle of nowhere, and just hoped they all died, and many of them do. It's the genocide that everybody is like, yep, yeah, that's fine. And it, it literally inspired Hitler. Head in there, follow the track for a bit. Thanks. Hey, slow up. I'll jump on. Like, you can see a quote of Hitler, I, I believe a quote, where he's like, well, America did it and nobody gave a fuck, so I guess we can do that to other people around here. I'm sorry for being a bit political, but it's like, what America did to the Native Americans is a touchy subject to me. I don't know why it's a touchy subject to me. I'm white and first generation American, except on another side of my family, but still it's like, what the fuck did, how is it that we're not put at the same level as the Nazis, you know? This place is perfect. I hope so. Gentlemen, we have survived for now. Now, it is time to prosper. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were onto something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. We have all made mistakes over the years, Hosea. Every last one of us. But I kept us together. Kept us alive. Kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now he doesn't look that old. East of the Grizzlies and out of money. And a, a long way from a dream of virgin land in the West. I know, my brother. But we are safe. We make a bit of money here. Then we move again. Head out around them. Be west of Uncle Sam. In a few months, buy some land. I hope so. <laughs> Would you just look around you? This world has its consolations. I don't know what that means. Gentlemen, I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, Herr Strauss. I prefer robbing banks to usury. Seems more dignified. Usury? Somehow. I don't know what usury is. Everyone, I guess it's basically being a loan shark, or as they call it around. these days, um, payday loans. I know that things have been tough. But we are safe now, and we are far too poor. So it is time for everyone to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Now get out there and see what you can find. Uncle, Reverend Swanson, no more passengers. <laughs> it is time for everyone What's that mean? to earn their Hookers? keep. There is a town, a little way down the track, named of Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, whatever it is that you find, the camp gets its slice. Now be sensible out there. Now the girls have your tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. We put you over here. I'm sure everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most of your She looks like a woman not that's in humid. You know, hairs well, just kind of going down. We can always make more money. We're gonna have to. Miss Jackson, I've seen shit with more common sense than you. Do it properly. Well, I was gonna cut it as soon as we got to camp, but like we're at the 30 minute mark, so that works out well.
Mm-hmm. Well, that's a good time to call it, so comment, cause like, comment, something you like, dislike, tips, tricks, otherwise, if you like my YouTube, and would like to see it grow, then please like, subscribe, and share the videos to have it grow, and please remember to spend a new to woo you animals to help control the pit population. Got off the mountain, rode east into some pretty enough country called the Heartland. Ain't been this far east in many a year. Dutch seems a little better. His eyes are sparkling once more. And My beard's going in. A little clearer. I think we all feel a little happier. Spot of black water and that whole mess. Arthur. Jose. Why is he holding his hand underneath the cup? It's quite a day. You afraid Let's some of the tea's gonna that. spill on There's the floor? A bunch of the boys already in Valentine. Bill, Charles, and Javier. And Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss came back with that creepy little smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm gonna read a book. <laughs> yeah. Thank you for watching. Boy, this game looks good. And see ya.